What's up, everybody? We are back with part 15 of the expert walkthrough for Dragon's Dogma. Now, here I am. It's 6.30 in the morning, and uh, I'm recording for you, and the only reason I'm doing so is because I can actually upload at a decent speed now. I, uh, I invested in some new internet. I officially have much faster internet than I did before, so now I can upload the, these videos at... Uh, Speeds that far exceed <laughs> my uh, previous performance. Now, I'm not sure if I ever properly told you guys how much I hated my old internet service provider. I mean, well, I, I hated them to an extent that I can't properly explain. I mean, let's just say it will go unspoken how much I absolutely hated them. So, what we're going to do today is, uh, we are going to go do a quest called the Water God Altar, in which we will aid a research team. It is actually a very, very good quest. I like it a lot. It will be my honor to show The choice is yours. Uh, hear the Duke's directive. That, uh... Hear the Duke's directive allows you to skip these two in which you can progress with the story, but... If you were smart, you would honestly never skip either of these quests. The loot that you gain from them is just... Man, you would lose so much money. You probably... I mean, some of the people in the comments told me that the route of monster infestation, like a fortress besieged, some people told me that on hard mode, you can leave that quest with like 550k. That's ridiculous. So we're definitely not skipping either of these, but we're going to do this one. Certainly. Then here are the details. <clears throat> By the Duke's decree, we spare no effort in gathering knowledge concerning the worm. As one arm of that pursuit, we aid the faith in their examination of ruins and relics. One such ruin has of late become home to monsters. We've received a request for escort. They've asked for you by name, sir. What response might I give them? No, well, I'd do it. My thanks, sir. His Grace has commanded the utmost attention be given to such matters. Pray, speak to Father Geoffrey at the cathedral in the city for details of the task. Were the decision mine, I would set every man we have to defending our strongholds. But such is our duty. He clearly does not agree with, uh, helping out with the faith. Alright, we need to prioritize this quest. Meet with Father Geoffrey in the Grand Soren Cathedral. And he is straight ahead of us. There he is. Well met, good arisen. It is a heartening boon to have your assistance in our endeavors. I will not keep you long, for the survey party has already set out from Grand Soren. They walk south to the ruins of the falls near the encampment. I know not what dangers await there, but I will rest easily knowing you accompany them. Pray fly now to their side and keep watch over them. Make her speed your steps, sir. Alright, so now we must leave Grand Soren. We have to run all the way back to the encampment, which is not terribly far away. I already showed you guys the shortcut through the mountains to get there. The only thing I'm concerned with is, uh how strong our equipment is going to be against the enemies here because there are going to be saurians sulfur saurians i believe and there's also a cyclops so we definitely need to stock up on curatives oh man i did not max out my rank yet i did not mean to click on that damn it i'm one rank away from maxing this class out and never having to use it again. I just want this final set of abilities. You seem to have your pigs. Okay, let's like. do What will it be today? I've got a decent amount of skills. Stepping stone leaps forward in a flying kick, then uses target as a foothold to jump still higher. That sounds really awesome and I would love to use it, but I'm saving my points. Fracture Dart. Whistle Dart loses an arrow that produces a piercing screech halting pose for a moment's time. 
That does not sound very viable in combat. I don't have any new augmentations. <sighs> you know... I really want that one. I really want that one too. Renders your jumping attacks more powerful. Nope. I really want that one, but I need to save my points. Gee, she maxed out her rank as a fighter, so... Okay. Dexterity and damping. What will it be today? Let's see if we can give my pawn some of her final abilities. Full Moon Slash is really good. Legion's Bite. That is awesome. Yeah, it basically gives you hyper armor. You can just keep attacking over and over and over again as much as you want. Even while you're being attacked. Like this, see, Legion's Bite is going to be what essentially allows her to... Uh, Take down these Saurians, even while they're smacking her with their spear. Oh, yeah. I do want the down crack, because that's basically like a, a one-hit kill. Or, not a one-hit kill, though. I prefer to have her with the down crack, because it essentially is like a one-hit tail cut for Saurians. If she can hit them with it. So we need to get out a bunch of healing items. We don't have very many. Oh yeah, the headless icon. Curses the user when invoked. Why on earth would I want to be cursed? <sighs> we need the salvation robes. What will it be today? Okay, let's put away our loot. Um, what am I not going to need? I'm not going to get cursed here. I could be blinded because the Saurians spit stuff that blinds you. Hmm. I don't need that. I don't need that. I do not need that. I don't really need that either, but I'm keeping it anyway. Yeah, I'm ridiculously heavy right now. Now there's no place to really mine here. Even if there is, I'll just let my pawn do it. White tactics. Ooh, torpor. I definitely want that dragon spit, though. Alright. Definitely lightening my load. For sure. I don't need that anymore. need any of that. That thing just looks terrible. Oh yeah, the dire wolf cape. I totally forgot about that. I'm gonna have to show that off a little bit. Um, put that away. The fishing bob. Man, she's carrying a ton of crap. We looted a lot in the catacombs. Well, my, uh... My pawn is going to get... A pretty damn good sword down here that I'm much looking forward to. Okay, she has plenty of healing items. Okay. We're almost done. I know this is painful to watch. They don't have anything. Okay. Good. I'll, I'll let her carry all the mushrooms. 
And actually, I'll give them all to this chick. Leela. Hmm. See, I do believe that the items preserve their youth if they're inside your inventory, but only then. Okay, she officially has a decent amount of stuff. Have your pick. Any you like. Come again. All right, I think we're good. Notice board quests. Ooh, we have more. Material witness. Okay. We have to escort Barnaby to Bloodwater Beach. Now, since he is not really... A, he is not exactly a super important NPC. We don't require him. I just might do that. But the sight earring really isn't that good of a reward. I'm not particularly <laughs> enthralled about that. All right. Let's heal up. We need to stay on our toes for this. Iron and steel home to an age. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, give me my options. The master works all you can't. Stilettos. I still haven't upgraded these things. I only need one more elongated claw. Just one more. I'm gonna need a freakish main for this thing. Damn it. Not upgrading that. Ooh, the frame plate. I should really not upgrade that and save my silver ore for something else. Now these... I'll go ahead and two-star that. Since it only needed one. Oh wow, I could have just maxed out the direwolf pelt. Or the direwolf cape had I not the used the damn pelt. Alright, let's look at our equipment. Now that's pretty cool. Let's see, what does this thing do? Okay, resistance to lightning. Resistance to slow, 7%. It's a very cool cape. I think I'm gonna give it to my pawn. You see, it makes her look pretty cool. Now her cape gives her more health, the one that she currently has, but that one makes her look so much cooler. Nope. Equip that shit. And it gives you better striking resistance. I'm all for it. So here's what I'm gonna do. Due to the fact that you can get elongated claws so easily from harpies, we are going to run out here where there is like a guaranteed group of harpies and we are going to run back to Grand Soren and we are going to max out our bow once we get one more because we only need one more and if I can three star my bow it will essentially double in damage we're gonna need all the power we have in order to do this Hey, is that a light cure? Yeah, it is. It's just chilling there. I don't care about those bandits. They do not concern me whatsoever. And I don't recommend getting their attention because they will always want to fight. And you'll know when you have the bandits' attention because you'll see like a little, you know, get them. Oh wow, that was easy. We leveled up. See, this this one has more defense because he uh, he had armor, and I think these are graves. Yep, grand graves. That is a wondrous healing item. And I think back here in this corner there are Saurians, but there's treasure, so it's worth the danger. I hope you don't mind getting wet. 
<clears throat> Come on, guys. Ah, there's one. Nope, wrong. Bam. Dang it. It'd be nice if you guys helped. I'm just going to sit here and kind of shoot him in the face. There we go. Alright, I'm a pawn leveled up. We are getting somewhere. This video is going quite well. Ah, oh, crap. Here's the lot of them. Yeah, this sucks. Buff my, buff my weapon. Buff my weapon. Buff my weapon. Buff my weapon. Thank you. Come on. Give me the fire. Yeah, they can still one-shot us. That's the problem. Now, the Saurians are weakest to ice, but having fire allows you to catch them on fire. You cut the tail faster. Oh, you go, girl. Cut the tail. I cut the tail, got it. Alright, we've got him. I will take all this loot. Got some good loot we did. And I do believe there's a chest back here and a mining point. What do you know? Oh, that's all it gave me? Come on. I can't search that. Alright. <clears throat> I'm taking their damn grapes. Because I like healing items. Alright, when do you guys mind? Do it. Do it. I'll sit here all day if you don't. There you go. Silver. Copper. Come on, we got like one more. More copper. I am not complaining. It's all good stuff that we did not have before. Now these, I'll pick these up simply because they're not useless. They, I mean, you can upgrade equipment with them, but they are best for money. So, all right, we got a poison sack. That's an excellent item. Okay. So now it's time to go find some some of those damnable bird creatures. I think the Cyclops is Cyclops is over here somewhere. It's like next to a pond or something. I really hope the griffin isn't still out here somewhere. That would be tragic. There they are. There's no Cyclops right now, but at least the Harpies are here. Now, the best way to hit Harpies is to fire multiple arrows. Ugh. Might as well use those. Ah! They would drop their useless pinions. Gotcha. Give me an elongated claw. Are you serious? Is there at least another one? There we go.
Ow. Ah, uh, you've got to be kidding me. None of them dropped any long 80 claw. None of them. Oh, hey, a chest. Angel's Period. I'm sick of getting those. I really don't have any use for these things. Alright, that doesn't matter. We will, uh... We will find harpies on the way there. As you've seen, they are... They literally infest the mountain trail, so... If not here, then... I guess we can find some harpies on the way there. Man, I really want to max this stupid class out so I can go back to being a ranger. Mm, wow. Hold on. We'll rob them in a single Oh, that was easy. Did it. Don't suppose you'd want to heal me. I mean, you are a mage. Okay. That'll work too. It is not a foe that we are going to fight, so get over it. Very well. I'm on my way. Now the assassin class, which is what I went with in my last playthrough, that has they have a really awesome ability. Where they uh, can increase your speed dramatically for a short amount of time. Give me that money. What's this? There you go. I'll never forget to pick up the money. You're not worthy to be one of my pawns if you don't pick up money. You missed. Dang. Ooh. I'll take that. Now, there are a bunch of goblins up here on this trail, which is, uh, can be, can be quite a nuisance if you're not on your toes. See, they're just chilling here. Now, you can catch them off guard like this, and you can do way more damage. I'm not worried about the Wormwood Sap. <clears throat> See, now they know where to go. So they're just kind of leading the way. But there are going to be bandits up here, so you need to watch yourself. We've already run into them once, and they always come back. Yeah. Come on, guys. I'm not the only person who doesn't like these bandits. Oh, dang, she's about to use Bolide. Crap, watch this. Really? Oh, I thought she was about to use Bolide, the the meteor attack. Is there truly no easier way to cross this mountain? Even though Bolide is, you know, your attack, it's coming from your pond, it's still freaking scary when it happens. You guys can help, you know. Yeah, we have a bunch of money. <laughs> I like it. Oh, crap. Nope. Yes! We maxed our rank out. I am literally tempted to just go back to Grand Store now. Yeah, I think I'm about to use a fairy stone and go back after I get my after I get my last 
harpy pinion. See, there's the bridge to the encampment. We're almost there. These go to the water gold altar. Really? Are there no harpies up here? What the hell? The pass is treacherous, master. Watch your head. This game truly loves to disagree with me. Grand Soren stands beyond this way castle. This way to the water god's altar. Oh, shut up. Holds like this one are crucial and we'll Okay, you know what? Yeah, we are definitely doing that. Um Monsters. Now that now that we've maxed out this class, we can finally stop using it. Cause I honestly I really did not want to go down to the water god the water god altar with this class. <laughs> yeah, I was not really digging that. Give me a fairy stone. Give me a fairy stone. No? Fine. I'm sure some of you have seen the Angry Joe review of this game. He's like, there is no quick traveling. It's really funny. Where'd he go? There he is. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me that. Give me that. Give me all that. Right. Can you like? What will it be today? I'm gonna put some shit away. I hate picking this stuff up. Goblin horn. See now we don't need this now we don't need this stupid elongated claw. What will it be today? Time to break out the longbow. Yeah, baby. Three stars. What will it be today? Have your pick. It's Come beautiful. Oh yeah, I miss having that much attack. And I'm pretty sure, pretty sure today? my augmentations stand strong. I am quite positive they do. It's radiant, so yeah, I'll take that. Scarlet kisses, why not? Okay. Yeah, sure. I mean, I like being able to see in the dark. I know you guys do as well. Even though I'm uploading in the highest quality I possibly can at a reasonable rate. Alright, now it's really time to go. So, let's munch on some grapes. And let's head to the Water God Altar. It's a really fun quest, this one is. It's, uh,. It's got some really good loot. My pawn, my precious, beautiful pawn, Valerie, is going to receive her first exceptionally strong sword from this quest if I'm lucky enough to get it. And since the sun is, the sun is kind of setting right now, we don't have to worry about the Griffin attacking. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Buff my weapon, baby. Buff my weapon. Well, you better. If you didn't know what to do, I wouldn't have hired you. Darn it. I should have upgraded my swords while I was at it. I don't want to waste Firefly Stone on these blades, because I'm about to get new ones, but... 
Still. God, every time your pawn sees anything whatsoever on the ground, it's always... Ooh, piece of candy. Now that way I have not explored yet. Yeah, this area over here, this is where we're going to explore when we do Griffin Bane. Such open areas are two-edged swords with him. Every monster for leagues can see us. Every monster is gonna get a taste of this. Bam! Now you see that? That's why I like being a ranger. Even in numbers, a weakling is a weakling still. Now, due to your inability, due to your inability to uh, move while doing some of the more powerful shots with the longbow, you are left wide open on certain occasions. But it's not necessarily a bad thing because you might be left wide open, but odds are you're going to absolutely obliterate whatever it is you're aiming at. I like poison arrows, I'm definitely going to use those. And these series of cliffs you can drop down and uh, it will take you right back. Yeah, I am human, what are you going to do about it? See? You got whooped. Oh crap, there are some hobgoblins over here. They're actually kind of tough. See, looks like she's casting Bolide. Yep, look at that. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Rap. Ow. What on earth was that? What hit me? I'll take that. Ah, don't let him throw rocks at you. Actually, actually does do damage. See, she just used the advanced trigger. That's a really cool attack. Bam. Oh. Money. Let's see what we can do about this. Oh. We have triumphed. It's over. No, we're not. We're not. No, we're not fooling with it any further, guys. Let's just go. We've wasted ah. We wasted enough time. Oh god. Well, this isn't good. No, we need. That'll work. Stop walking. Where'd he go? Jeez. That was strange. He disappeared. Oh, what are these? Love me my healing items. Uh, no. <laughs> Shall we jump? That's a good question, Valerie. Shall we commit suicide? The decision is yours. And some of the stuff that this these pawns say is pretty funny. Need to stay the two rangers is a pretty, pretty potent combination for this quest. Is there truly no easy I know you can get up here. There's usually like a, an archer sitting up here. Let's break out the lantern. 
We've got plenty of oil. Oh, wow. It is more effective. My lantern is way more... way brighter. I like this. I might keep that as a permanent augmentation unless something else just completely overpowers it in usefulness. Which I can't see it happening because a lantern this bright is actually pretty good. Alright. Um, now, since judging by the red circle on the map, you're going to want to go this way, but it's not. You need to go across the bridge and down this giant metal, or to this giant rocky valley. You have to go down there, then you have to go this way and get to the entrance of the waterfall. Going this way, I'm pretty sure it only leads you to a mining point, but I'm going to show you why you don't go this way. Like See? And you don't want to try and drop right there. You will not like the results. Valerie, mine. A rock? Another rock? And a pretty stone. I'll take it. So I will show you the correct way to go in order to get to... Because I remember the very first time I played this game, it took me forever to find this place. I literally could not find it. I kept going that way, and I kept falling down and dying, trying to get down. I eventually went this way and found the correct place to go. Money. Okay, this is the way that you need to go, and that's a rabbit. <laughs> I'm such a jerk. Yeah, we need to get down here. Goblin! Even in numbers, a weakling is a weakling still. Oh, I can't believe I just missed. What are you guys gonna do? Ow. Bam. Ow. They're actually doing damage. She's using that crazy meteor attack again. Oh, what? Can't believe that just happened. He's just dancing. I got him. Anybody gonna help me out? Nobody. Yeah, baby. I've learned a new way to fight their ill strength in numbers. We have triumphed. You gotta keep an eye out for those giant coin pouches. And even the regular ones. What's this? Hmm. This is their little camp. Ah. I think there's a hobgoblin in here. No? Well, alright. Mine. For crap's sake, mine. Valerie? I'm sick of having to tell you what to do. You guys get out of the way so she can do her thing. Very well. Mine. Mine! 
Really? See, I'm sure there's good ore in here, too. That's the problem. Thank you. See? Silver. Totally worth it. Ancient ore. Completely worth it. And more silver. Now mine over here. Since this is the one you refuse to mine, I'm sure it has the best. Go, 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 go. Please? Please mine? Okay, fine. Silver. Silver. Ancient. Look at that. Do you see what happens when you just listen to me? Now I have to give everything back to you. Yeah, that ancient ore is pretty heavy, but it's good. Alright, this way to the ruins. Ugh, I'm so tired. I have to work in like six hours. <laughs> really sucks. But it's alright. Glad to be here doing this for you guys. Ah. Alright. There's nothing beyond that waterfall, pretty sure. In fact, I'm almost positive there's nothing there. The place you want to be is across. Like, up here. Oh, come on. You can make that. Yeah, up here is the place you want to be. There's another mining spot. Now be careful here, because the water will drag you off and you'll take fall damage. Across this river, the terrain is wild and buried here. We best choose our path carefully. Okay, you can go all the way up there, and I'm pretty sure there's just another mining spot, but this is the place that we want to be. I'll make her be good. Are you the Arisen, sir? I am of the party sent <coughs> to survey the ruins. I've seen no sign of Brother Jean. He had gone on ahead. I dearly wish I could run to his aid, but as you've seen, I am the Faith's greatest craven. I beseech you, sir. Find Jean within and see him safe. All right. <sighs> I will find the missing brother, but I'll do it in the next part. <laughs> so, uh, no, it's already saving for me. Good stuff. Um, all right. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here. And uh, as usual, I thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next part.